Thanks for messing around and Vampire Survivors Beswick Space Dude is gonna be enraged on Lake Foscari because I lost it 2830 because Stalker showed up a bloody gun and took three lives. And because I was such high level that any green knights were killable. Seriously, I had almost 200,000 kills. There was no way I should have been losing. But nope, I had to get Quintuple Stalker. Oh, yeah, it's nothing but fire and fury from now on. Because once again, it is way too close to the post timeless video. First chest here can evolve, so that's why I'm getting Photon Storm up ASAP. Or Phaser up ASAP to turn into Photon Storm. Okay, go for the Clovers. It's not even like it's not an inverse or I have super high curse or anything. Just the Green Knights, level 200, they have so much health, they weren't going down fast enough. Even, uh, someone who had almost 200,000 Ks on hurry. Maybe I should have just sat in the Sammy zone. Or maybe I shouldn't have been attacked by so many bloody stalkers that it was impossible to get anything done. Because if I had those three revives they took, then it would have been fine. But I didn't. And the early evolution chest has not spawned in. That's not it. That's the three minute boss one. Yep. Which means that I'm down power. A lot of power. Power that made his stats go ba 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 up. And I'm actually a higher level than I was the last time I got off this high, too. Granted, it won't affect what I need to do that much. And, uh... I mean, I didn't get awake, because, well, why would I need awake? I had five revives. Apparently, I needed eight. Maybe more durable, too. Ugh. But at least I have four more golden eggs in my pocket to level up with. That'll make all the difference in the world, clearly. Oh, and you know, a stalker just ate a rosary. Took that head on and didn't fall. Amazing. Might as well take out the Atlantean early. How are you getting in? Oh, there's a chest. Will it evolve? No. Doesn't matter. So many levels wasted. And all because the early evolution chest did not feel like spawning in. Because what would life be with, you know, having any luck whatsoever? Not mine, that's for sure. Not mine. Half a percent of a cooldown. Well, at least you can listen to that sweet jamming music. Da 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 da. I cannot do sound effects for the life of me. I can't do a lot of things that people think I can do. I 
but keep insisting I can do. Oh hey, the double effect fired off. Nope. Oh my god. Well, there's a rosary down there, but it's too dangerous to grab. And also, it wouldn't affect him anyway, because he's too high up. Now, uh, what about the one in the maze? Might be able to grab that one. Where is it at? There you are. I oh, just barely snuck around. You're an evolution chest, though. And you're a penta, but you didn't give me multiple. At least if it's photon storm first. That's the best one, so I have that going for me now. Yeah, that figures. Alright, no more moving until I get this chest here. Okay, that's two down. Oh, the worst of the two. For what I need, anyway. Da 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 Arcana chest, and I will not be not taken awake. Apparently, I do need seven revives. Or, well, gonna be eight. Alright, next time the chest shows up, I don't grab it. I level up first. Then I grab it. I still need the weapon pickup case. Try to stay away from any red gems, like that one over there. And these ones... Uh-oh, there's a lot of them. Nope. No. There we go. Okay, there's the pronto laser. Now I just... Smash that random always button and we are... Clean! I'm not even half a million, or not even 50,000. He had 100k before 20 minutes. That's crazy. It was at like 1,770,000. No, it was 180,000. By the time I got to 28. No, I don't think it was that high. Well, it was really high regardless, but still. Yeah, I'm gonna go hang out with the Sammies. Just because I want endless fruit pies. I really don't feel like losing again. Because again, this is completely thrown off and put me back a good 20 bloody minutes. That could have been done doing anything else. Oh, is that rock not solid? Is this where they all spawn in? Need to find the best spot for it. They spawn in, they're not spawning in green knights. And they're spawning in healing too, which helps, yay, healing. Okay, guess I'm just standing here till Stalker inevitably shows up and kills me. 
Because what else would he do with his non-life? Commit to respecting boundaries? I guess I could, should go after the Atlanteans. I do have 10 minutes before this happens. Get myself another four golden eggs. That'll clearly make a difference. When instead I could just do two minutes of farming on Sammy and get enough gold to get you like 500. Not like another clover is going to be bad. Oh, I fire so slow that you are actually getting in. Alright, grab the clover and head up and quench the volcano Atlantean. With the sun destroyed, the moon is all right. No longer has to deal with all those terrible solar rays destroying its surface. He couldn't even move last time. It was incredible. In fact, I'm just going to use the video of me destroying the volcano and landing in half a second from that video. Because it'll show the difference between the power. What? That bloody hell hit me. Hell isn't a swear. No, seriously. That was eight armor. How do you do that much damage to eight armor? That was like 50 damage hits. I blinked and I was dead. No, seriously, what the hell? Armor can't be working correctly. I'm taking way too much damage at the moment from things that should not be doing any damage. I gotta go check their ours good entry. Cause that was like 50 HP in what half a second. They'd have to be doing like 30 a hit to be doing that. And nothing goes that high. Even the Atlanteans and stuff don't go that high. Really? Oh, you lasted way too long. I might as well get you just to make it easier to go along. I mean, sheer speed doesn't really... Movement speed doesn't really matter that much when the entire map is enemies. Heck, I even had two rosaries stocked up. Wiped the screen twice. It still wasn't even close to enough. Two revives and two rosaries. I got up to 28 minutes. 28.38. It was awful. Just absolutely atrocious. It's space, dude. There should be no issues whatsoever. Well, I broke 100k. This is so low, comparatively. Oh, I can save the NFT for you. I was hitting the Avatar Gaia so much it couldn't even get him close. It was literally just stuck entirely. Incapable of doing anything. Like, not even with NFT or anything, just with the basic Pronto Beam. Plus the other stuff firing off. 
the difference in power is crazy. Oh, hey, a candy box. I also got two candy boxes from the random draw, too. It was weird. And just look at that green knight boss coming in and dying. And just know that when they spawn in like a wave, they all just get pushed in you because they're so big. Really, back to back. Alright, pain about to come in. I definitely had the Avatar guy down before this happened. Oh my god. Good grief. This is crazy. Oh my god. Am I still gonna lose this with three revives? With Awake and with Tier Jisoo and double weapon power up. What a crazy nightmare of an ending. Oh, I get bad random event for the final. I don't even get to fight the dang Abyssal Scarry enemy things. And it's back to the ever popular combination of Boss Rash and Moon Glow to finish this episode out because I have less time than ever before to do this. Don't you just hate people? See, laser better. Laser, even better. No, Diver Mines, I will not take you intentionally if I ever have to. Yeah, get as many bosses going as possible. I haven't muted myself, I'm just not talking. Because I have to do Boss Rash and Moonlow again. A combination of bad luck and people once more screwing me over. It would be nice to take a day off. You know, catch up on everything. Establish a real backlog. But no, I would require people not threatening to kill me every bloody day. That shouldn't have grabbed. Oh, yeah, I should have grabbed that. Uh, no, neither of you were upgraded yet. Here's the better one. Too many levels is gonna be too many problems. Now, well, that's what awake is for. You know, I have two minute waves to go through with that. Oh boy. 
And because it's boss rash, they're going to be even more durable. Should have saved that for them Reaper Brothers. Well, I have another one, so it doesn't matter if I grab this one yet. Is that a vacuum or... A, I think that's just a vacuum, yeah. Yep, let's grab everything then. Get that red gem away from that turkey in the corner. Nope, you're just a gem. Turkey time. You're just another vacuum. Reroll. There shouldn't be any too many levels, but I can save awake for the third one. No issue with that. Alrighty. I'll just stand on the spawn boss button and well, no, I need to take down the light sources just to try. See if I can get another Rosary or an Aurelogian spawned in. You're a vacuum. Don't need you. Clear you just so you're not on top of anything that could spawn in better. Same with you. Go to the corner, they say. Save the world, they say. I don't know what the spawn logic is. Like, how far do I have to go off? Is it just a teensy bit off screen? Do I have to go all the way to the corner? Well, it's spawning at some point. Maybe I don't even have to go up. Maybe it's to the right. Okay, it did spawn in eventually at some point. No idea when, though. That would have been helpful to know. Well, I'm barely paying attention to what the mobs are actually doing. I'm all about getting them light sources. Oh, too many levels. I have way too many levels. Well, it's only it's my fault. You know, I could have just woken up five hours earlier and gotten no sleep. Done it that way. Uh-oh, no ender, er, ender, and I have nothing to strike you with. Well, time to awake. I'm not falling again. I literally do not have any time left. I'm not even... The other one was done processing before noon. I just didn't set the timer correctly. Noon. It's not noon. Well, I mean, it was done before noon. That's not when I post it. Well, I mean, it, technically it is, since it's always going to be noon somewhere if I post 1 p.m. EST. Uh, Chicago, I think. Yeah, Chicago.
Ah, giant robot time. Bearable. And running right into them. Well, actually, I do enough damage to take down the robots. Well, golems, but I'm just gonna keep calling them robots because they look more robot-y than golem -y to me, even though if you think about it. Are robots not just golems anyway? Just with metal and circuits instead of mysticism. There's most of them gone. Okay, and this is the Oral Logan, so that's actually good. I can save it for when the Gyorutans spawn in. Get in a nice safe corner. Oh, they're spawned outside too. And there's no avoiding that. Can't avoid this one though. You just slowly crawl into a corner and die. I can't believe I need to wake again. Moon glow, yay! I didn't want to have to resort to doing this, but I'm going to keep getting screwed over by poor luck and other people. I'm going to have to. And yes, he hasn't beaten Moonglow, so there's that at least. Oh, I can see if I can take down the Atlanteans at least. Hey, Golden Merchant. How is it going? Nope, go faster. I think the closer I am to that, the more NFT I have on the Alliant Gonna be the only way I kill the thing. Dang. Well, that's all I can do. Suppose I can try and get something good out of this. Nope. At the very least, I should max out Phaser. That'll just change the paradigm pretty easily. Yeah, just look at how fast it's going off already. I'll get the revive just so it's out of the pool. And Empty Tome is still Empty Tome. <laughs> yeah, I've shouted myself hoarse. At least better than showing myself giraffe. That would just be weird. You can't possibly evolve me. There's no point in touching you at all. Oh boy. And of course there's a shooter spawning in. See you, laser.
Riveting. I mean, ideally, I should be going after the other Atlanteans already. Two. I should just spawn them in and then book it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Never evolve on Moon Glow. It lasts half a second. Of course, there's crab battle, of course. Oh, I can't really do anything about it either. I'm too underpowered. And the Sonic Blooms just keep getting eaten up. I think I even missed saying a crab battle in boss rush, that's how tired I am of this. Let civilization be destroyed. What value is there in any city of Atlantean? I'm just gonna close my eyes. actually that photon storm boy is the damage not there there really needs to be and a starburst yay starburst take that you plant thing and you give me an arcana and I am desperate enough to take a wake on moon glow because obviously 87 stalkers are about to show up and destroy me. That can happen. Huh. You can get double evolution off of one weapon pickup. I mean, probably have a video of that before, but I don't think I consciously noticed it before. But getting two Contra weapons, Operation Guns weapons, off of one weapon power-up. Normally you would need two. Ironically, it makes you weaker. Because you won't get a second weapon pickup, and the revive that comes with it.
Stone mask, eh? Stone mask. Get Phoenix blasted. I don't even get a set third arcana here. It's only these two. Gotta risk it for the blasting. At least I got some eggs off this. It's quitting time. Time to quit the game. 386. 387. And 388 for Space Dude on the Vampire Survivors Beswick. Takes us down to 1,544 more to go. That is so many. We're closing in on the 400 mark. Shouldn't be long now. In fact, it should already be here, but hey. Who could do anything about the weather other than everyone on the planet? Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Double thanks to anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. And please do so if you haven't. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in Vampire Survivor's Beswick.